This one is Jinu Kim. Jinu Kim uh, is part of the Korean Institute of Design Promotion. Uh, the company, that organization has remained at the forefront of Korea's pursuit of design excellence, helping the nation rise as a central figure in the global design arena. When I say central figure, uh, they're actually this big. Uh, when I was in Korea last December, they gave me this nice uh, annual. And the title of the annual was Design Korea, Korean Power. And I just felt like it was just so, so overwhelming to have those lines, to have those words as a mantra for a design organization. Design Korea, Korean power. I, I hope one day we can say that about the Philippines. And say, maybe, I guess we could right now. And, uh, but the idea is to, to say that eventually about our products and say, this is about Filipino power. This is about Filipino ingenuity and all that. Um, one large manifestation of design power, or this design Korea, or Korean power, what, um, I saw first hand, um, first hand by myself when I was in Times Square last November. Uh, there was this large billboard. It says Seoul Design Capital, or was it Design City? This World Design Capital or World Design City for 2010 2011. And this was in Times Square in New York. And this is a billboard about Seoul. How big, how great is that? So right now we have Jinu Kim. Hi, my name is Jinu Kim, and I work for Design Policy Development Team in Korea Institute of Design Promotion. And it's my great privilege to be invited as a speaker for the State of Philippine Design Talk. And I thank you so much for my friend Brian to organize this great event. And I believe this will help uh, Philippines to um, achieve your success through by adapting um, a design as a strategy in your country. So. Recently, uh, the president of Design Management Institute in Boston, Mr. Thomas Lagut, he insisted that U.S. also pay attention to establishing government-funded design council for their future growth. As he said, um, government needs to pay attention to the social problems, business competitiveness, and there are a lot of ways to choose what can be the strong uh, power for empowering the country. And the point is design. Korea has a long history of design promotion. Let's say it has been about 40 years, and this is going together with my organization when government first established a design center for the packaging because Korea just started to make product, and we didn't have proper packaging system. And government recognized the importance of packaging in the beginning of the industrial uh, revolution in Korea. Now, Korea is one of the leading design countries. You may recognize the brand of Samsung, LG, and Hyundai. And if you say what's the secret, I would say all the people, including government, business, educational sectors, they work hard to follow the other leading countries like Japan, US, uh, Italy, and UK. I wouldn't say government did it by itself. Also, I believe that business did even better jobs, like Samsung has stronger brand than our national brand. Sometimes we feel that one uh, big corporation can change the image of the country as um, finishes case. Nokia represents Finland as one of the innovative country. However, government's role is very important, especially countries like growing right now and I believe some of Asian countries even they show better results by working together in the leadership of government and Japan did, Korea did, Taiwan, China and I, I believe Philippines can do even better jobs when government lead the role of um, emphasizing importance of design. The government in Korea emphasize the design and they invest on money and as well as Seoul City is doing the same work and we are not actually competing, we are cooperating however they focus on city, we focus on country level so we have a lot of project covers whole South Korea and Seoul City mainly focus on um, introducing Seoul and improve, improving the public design of Seoul 
will be seen as the effect when city government and um, state government work together. And KIDP and Seoul City, they have Seoul Design Foundation. We are closely working to exchange information, share the ideas, and also I think we're going to co-host some of the events in the near future. People say South Korea has been successful in promoting design by government's initiatives and business strong participants, also the education. You can see a lot of Korean students studying abroad, especially in New York. 50% uh, of international students are from Korea, and they come back to Korea to show their best um, ability to improve Korea design. And also, they, they find their position in overseas to show the national brand as a Korean who is talented, also show great innovative uh, works in their companies. Thank you, Jin.